I think we're going to go to our first uh, fan question because wow. uh, yeah 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 <laughs> actually we, we really have to thank uh, one Muhammad sebab banyak soalan dia bagi I think at least four his first question of oh, many oh, was yeah, yeah um why do MSL teams not uh, publicize the transfer fees like in the foreign leagues and this is a question I had also because of course you know you when you see Mbappe's rumors and all you get like yeah. 200 million lah, this lah, that one. But you don't really see that in Malaysia. Why is that? Uh, okay. How do I answer? Okay, I, I'll, <laughs> I'll give you the general lah, general lah. See, yes. uh, what happens currently in our league, team will do the budgeting for the season. Mm-hmm. Right? The entire season. Uh, okay, they register 30 players for the first team. Uh, of course, don't forget, they have the official coaches also in the payroll lah. Yes. So normally it's about 45 lah. My experience, why why I say 45? Because why we do the Malaysia Cup medal lah, it's 45. Final. So we know lah, like 45 people lah. Maybe, yeah, I could be wrong, okay? Because maybe they have the other admin staff. So uh, they forecast, the that means the A players, B players, C players, the salary scale, all right? So uh, normally they, they sign free agents. Okay, and players who have contracts, they try to take on loan. You know, uh, there are clubs oh, who pay okay. uh, some fees, small fee for loans that I know, I have experienced. Okay, and uh, correct me if I'm wrong, to my knowledge, uh, GDT did pay some transfer fees for certain players. Mm-hmm. Uh, but of course, yes, it's not disclosed. Uh, uh, what do you call it? In public, the actual mm-hmm. amount, yeah. you know, uh, and of course it's up to clubs, you know, uh, and uh, that's why when I said is our we we haven't come to a level whereby uh, transfer is so interesting, <laughs> you know. In, in Europe, it's like people will know. Oh, if you see right, Mbappe, you know, he got a very what signing fee. Uh, I think if I'm not mistaken, about hundred million, right? Yeah, something. yeah, and they're giving him directorship of the club according to something. Oh <laughs> So, so, so this uh, excitement that fans wants to see, yeah, you know. Yeah. But of course, they, they have the avenue to offer all this, mm. you know. They have the, the 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 substantial things to to cover all the cost. So, but because you see, in our league, uh, not many teams will buy over and and uh, declare. But I'm sure they they declare to MFL or, or FAM, right? Because it's a transfer, right? The transaction, and all that, and then of course you pay. Someone will receive what it goes in from company <laughs> to company, know. right? FC, FC yeah. is in real hard now, you know. I so, know. Uh, so it's just that they don't disclose to the public, you know. Uh, but what was uh, normally lah? What in the industry they said? Oh, the remaining salary of the player. That means if they earn about ten thousand per month, this fella have another year of contract. It's about hundred twenty thousand. And then maybe to his uh, status, uh, that means, oh, he played for national team, maybe they add another 30, 40,000, something like that. That was the calculation that, that was done before. You know, something like that, lah, that I was uh, heard. Okay, uh, it's a good question. I mean, for me, of course, uh, we love to, to see all these things, you know, to get the league exciting. You know, fans will be buzzing, hey, this transfer, and then suddenly, you know, because it happens in Europe, you see, like, okay, the deal has done, I mean, they have agreed, but suddenly mm-hmm. along the way, one team called the player, oh, sorry, I've got a better offer, I'll, I'll make a U-turn, you know, mm-hmm. so it happens a lot, right, here, yeah, but not in Malaysia at the moment. Happens you know? a lot to my team, lah. yeah. <laughs> to uh, Man United, it happens a lot, lah. <laughs> uh, sorry, I, I didn't, uh, Man United play in the Wish League, huh? Scottish Premier League. Oh, you are Jahan, five hours. Yeah? No, no, we, we just missed out on Conference League. Yeah, please, please. Conference League. <laughs> How many years you've been missing? La, you know? See, example. See, like, see, see it, hmm. it can happen to. A big club, see like Man United, all right? Yeah. For a number of years, they have not been performing. Imagine eh, a big club, you know. So it can happen to small clubs also, like clubs in Malaysia, you know. Mm. 
So it's all about structure, all that, you know. I think what after Ferguson era, you can see the downtrend, you know. Uh, so let's see lah. But of course, I hope they they recover lah. Coming seasons, you know, we 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 miss them in the competitive <laughs> level. Navi, <laughs> you take the next question. I cannot have to recover. I have to recover. <laughs>